Welcome to the ProSystem FX Knowledge Coach video series. In this video, we'll look at a new enhancement available in the December update to Engagement 7.5 and Knowledge Coach 2.5 that allows you to work in engagement binders that contain Knowledge Coach work papers in a shared file room environment. Shared file room is a feature that Engagement has had for many years, and it allows multiple users to work directly on the same binder at the same time without synchronizing, checking out work papers, or assigning work papers. In previous releases, you were blocked from opening binders that contained Knowledge Coach work papers when logged into a shared file room. Now we have opened up this feature to Knowledge Coach binders. For more information on how to use shared file room feature, please visit the Engagement User Guide. There is a topic called Sharing and Distributing Binders. Using shared file rooms is a subsection underneath that. And there is a lot of important information here about how to enable shared file rooms in your firm within the administrator module and how to ensure that staff have the proper staff group rights. To share your file room as a host, you'll log in to engagement using either the office or field mode. And then on your local file room icon, right click and you'll see an option that says shared file room. You'll get a message that says the file room has been successfully shared and you'll click OK. From this point on, the other users on your team will choose shared file room in the select location dropdown on the engagement login screen when they log in, and then they will see the contents of your local file room that you just shared. Now we'll open up a binder that contains Knowledge Coach work papers. I'll say do not refresh diagnostics for now. And when the binder opens, I'll expand all of the work papers. Notice that, that towards the right hand side of the screen, there is a live editor column that replaces the current editor column that you see uh, in normal office or field mode. This indicates who currently has the editing rights to that particular work paper. You'll notice that non-Knowledge Coach work papers like regular Word and Excel documents, the trial balance, trial balance reports, and others all show as available. This means that anyone who's logged into the shared file room can open these work papers, edit them, and save changes. Knowledge Coach work papers, on the other hand, are shown as unavailable. This means that they are not available for editing in the shared file room. This is due to restrictions we currently have around flowing the information between Knowledge Coach work papers, and we will be working on opening up this capability in a future release. However, even though you cannot edit the work papers, you can open them and view them. I'll open the audit program for cash. When you open up a Knowledge Coach work paper in the shared file room, You'll get a message that says that the work paper is read only and that any changes made in the work paper will not be saved. I'll choose OK. Notice that the top of the work paper in the title bar also lists the work paper as read only. You are able to change things in the work paper. So, for example, if I want to change this answer to the tailoring question from yes to no, I can do that and the changes will actually flow through to other Knowledge Coach work papers if they affected other Knowledge Coach work papers, but these changes will not be saved when you close the work paper. When I'm ready to close the work paper, I will be asked if I want to save the changes. Even if I say yes, I will get a message that says you cannot save changes to this work paper as it is read only and I'll choose OK. I'll close that work paper again and say no. When I'm back in the work paper in the binder frame, I can do things like sign off as preparer or reviewer. I'll get the normal messages about diagnostics. I'll say yes. I can also write review notes on Knowledge Coach work papers. So I can do a fair amount of review work in the shared file room, even though these work papers are read only. This concludes the video walkthrough covering the process of how to use Knowledge Coach work papers in a shared file room environment. Thanks for joining us.
Is your firm looking for on-demand e-learning? Check out our available courses online today.